so welcome to a new video. This is the Gateshead flyover, a concrete structure built in the 1960s. It's part of a plan to build a motorway network across the northeast, and unfortunately, it's now been closed since mid December since they found out that uh, part of the structure was unsafe. As we look back down here, you can see the massive ram that's been put in place to support the flyover and uh, currently Gates has lost four lanes of traffic in each direction. See that ram there? We'll take a walk down and we'll have a closer look. So the structure here is just to the back of Gateshead Town Centre, that's uh, Gateshead High Street that you can see there. And uh, so these rams have been put in place, so uh, above the road surface here is uh, a drain which apparently runs through the structure there and they've had to prop the fly over here because of the danger of the collapse and apparently the metro runs underneath here so Metro runs in a tunnel underneath this structure. All the all the drainage apparently runs through there. And you can see all the bits of damage along the road surface, along the edge where the structure's been failing. There is talk online that the structure was actually the flyover was actually due to be removed by the end of the decade, so Hopefully there is a long-term plan for what they were going to do here. But this is the road's now closed, likely permanently, to traffic from uh, Lowfell in and Reckonton into Gated. A huge ram there, propping the structure in put in over Christmas so it allowed the metro to be reopened. And this, this was built in the 60s, meant to be part of a much bigger network of roads and we'll see from the drone in a second how only part of this was built. But it's now just, it's crumbling and it's had to be supported. Only a mile, I think it's a mile long of it that was constructed before construction of the motorway network would have led to a new bridge over the Tyne, but none of that was ever built. And all we're left with now is this what has been a busy road for a number of years, but will now need to be removed. So you can see here the, the ram underneath the road there. See the ram there propping up this surface. It does look like there's a fair bit of land to the back where they could build maybe a relief road, but I believe there's houses being built on there now. So you can see all those that drain runs across the road there where the structures failed. Looking up towards Gateshead, you can see the road runs off into the distance, got two slip roads on and off. Where this flyover then runs across. That's the drainage you can see there. It's a very usually busy road which is 
now closed. You can see there as we look towards the Sage and the Time Bridge. You can see the the key the Millennium Bridge there as well. So the road it was intended to actually continue down towards the river. Cross the cross the Tyne on a new cross and you had the slip roads there that have been blocked off. Time bridge in the distance, just visible to the right of the flats, finally getting the attention that it needs after years of becoming rusty. But that uh, small section of what was intended to be a network of roads, well, this likely all now need to be demolished. I can't see they're going to repair it. So at some point, this huge flyover will have to be removed. There does seem to be enough land in the foreground as well for them to maybe build some kind of temporary road around to relieve some of the pressure that the closure is going to put on the town, but there's such a lot of capacity that's been lost. You know, out, we were here at the weekend and there was traffic queuing on the roundabout below here as people try to make their way around into the diversions. But this structure is now just crumbling. So it was formerly part of the A1, uh, which had been planned to run through Newcastle. But the uh, A1, as we now know, was diverted around Gateshead and around Newcastle. It's that joint there that seems to be the uh, the, the issue. It's where the, the props are underneath. So that drainage channel Looks like the only one once you look across the bridge. Doesn't seem to be another one. And looking out over that very different gated skyline from a few years ago. Yeah, that was uh, one for autonomous shenanigans, maybe, to consider that. I think you might have already done a video on this motorway project, like the London Ring Roads was never completed. That'll be a huge project to to take this down. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you in the next one.